Welcome to the video presentation on Introduction to Personal Protective Equipment, PPE and Tools and Plants, TNP. PPE is the safety equipment we wear, use for our safety from any injury or accident while working. Hence, these are called Personal Protective Equipment. Safety tools are those tools which ensure us safety while carrying out work on power lines like HV and LV tester, discharge rod, chain, shorting clips, ladder, rope, danger signboards, caution and do not operate tags, safety cones, caution tape and so on. Further, we will discuss the tools and tackles commonly used in power distribution company. Let us start with PPE. Greetings, I am Akshay Waklu. Now, I will tell you about Personal Protective Equipment, PPE. Personal Protective Equipment consists of many items of equipment. However, in power sector, we use only six main items of equipment which are necessary for the linemen to carry out their work. The first item is the safety helmet, which protects the head. The second is visor to protect the face. The third is a full body safety harness to protect from fall while climbing poles. The fourth is insulated safety shoe to protect from electrical leakage or shock. The fifth item is insulating rubber gloves to be used when working on LT live line and the sixth item is safety reflective jacket. Now, I will tell you in detail about safety helmet. The outer coating of the safety helmet is hard. It protects the head. On the inside, it has a cushion which absorbs shocks in front and at the back. There is an adjustable fitting. This strap should be tight at the chin so that the helmet does not fall off the head. Now, I will tell you about the visor. It protects your face and eyes from sharp tiny objects while drilling on walls. Now, I will tell you about safety harness. What you see here is the full body safety harness. This is secured below the waist in three places. The thigh waist and chest. You can see that the belt of the safety harness protects the waist against spinal injuries. Along with safety harness, you can see that there is a safety rope. It has a lock which opens and closes from both ends on pressing. Here are the safety shoes. If the shoes match the size of the feet, it is even better. For the hands, there are safety gloves which are rubberized. These provide safety to the lineman by safeguarding him against shocks. Let us look at the special fireproof jacket. It has a shield on chest and hands used by the lineman while working in front of live line for operations and other activities. Now, we will learn about tools and plants, T and P. This is the torch for the lineman. While working during night, a lineman must carry a torch with high beam light. This is a line tester. It is used to check LT supply present in the line or wires for overhead or underground lines, both for HT and LT power lines. HV and LV tester is used. It is 2 meters in length and can be extended to 4 meters. Its lamp glows with beep sound when it touches a live line. After confirmation that the line is dead with the help of HV and LV tester, the line is discharged to the earth with the help of a discharge rod. This is the earth connecting lead. It is used to discharge the HT or LT line to ensure that there is no backfeed of electricity in the line before starting work. This is an earthing or grounding chain. It is used for creating a safety zone after discharging the line. Wherever we work, we create a safety zone by connecting this chain with earthing. These are open-ended spanners. These are used to open or tighten any nuts and bolts. These are screwdrivers, which are used to remove or fix any screws. 
The next tool is the hacksaw, which is very important for a lineman. These are adjustable spanners. They are used when the open-ended spanners cannot be used for opening nuts and bolts. Coming to hammer, it is important to have a hammer of a correct size. Hammers are used for hammering items wherever required. It is important that the wooden handle of the hammer is correctly fixed to the hammer head. It should not be loose, else linemen can get injured. The next tool is the crimping machine with die. Different types of sockets are used in electrical work. These are the dies used for such sockets. Usage of such sockets is very important. Always remember that the sockets should never be fixed using hammer. They should be punched using the crimping machine only. Let us now look at the other tools. Tape in various colors like red, yellow, blue and black. The colored tape is used based on the face the lineman is working. Also, here is the HD tape, which is an important item that a lineman uses. CRC is used wherever the equipment is carbonized to remove the carbon deposits. Ladder. Three types of straight ladders are used in electrical work. Wooden ladder, aluminium ladder, fiberglass ladder. The most stable angle for a portable ladder is approximately 75 degrees or at 4 by 1 slope according to height of ladder. Thus, ladder is kept maximum angle of 75 degrees to the wall or pole. A technical helper must firmly hold the ladder at the bottom in case of pole upper portion of ladder is not tied to the pole. HV and LV tester. It is a protective instrument which gives alarm indication of live HV and LV lines from a distance of 5 meters. HV and LV tester is fitted to a PVC conduit pipe 50 mm of 2 meters length and extension rod of 3 meters. It has LED indicator and audio alarm speaker which produces beep sound when its point is brought near the live line. It has three modes, on, off, and test mode operated through battery backup. If there is no beep sound and no indicator lamp light, it shows that power supply is dead at that point. Discharge rod. It is an insulated rod with an extension rod, having resistance or corona capsule at the end, which is connected with an earthing lead. After availing the permission to shut down and before taking up the work, all the live conductors are discharged and earthed. Overhead lines are discharged with the help of the copper hook. If you see this board, it is written danger in local language and in English. The status of the line voltage should be mentioned as per requirements of safety measures of CEA. Installation of danger board displaying the danger of voltage is mandatory. Safety cones. Safety cones are usually cone-shaped markers that are placed on roads or footpaths to redirect traffic safety. Combination pliers. These are used for cutting, removing, insulating, joining and twisting electric wires and cables on power lines. They can be used even when current is passing through them. Adjustable wrench. Adjustable wrench is used to open and close nuts and bolts in case a spanner of the right size is not available. Common sizes vary from 8 inches to 12 inches. Adjustable wrenches are designed to provide a wide range of capacity in a single tool and are very convenient. Pipe wrench. It is used to open or close conduit. GI pipes and valves. Common size is 10 inch. The design of the adjustable jaw allows it to look in the frame such that any forward pressure on the handle tends to pull the jaws tighter together. They are usually made of cast steel. Measuring tape. It is used to measure the length of wires, cables and space. Use of measuring tape helps in efficient use of cable, thus saving and reducing wastage. These are made of cotton or metal strips with sizes of 10 feet to 100 feet. Ratchet with drill bit, hand drill. 
it is used to make holes in wooden cross arms and wooden cleats for tight fitting ht and lt cables coming out from dp structures lt transformer bushings electric drill machine it is a portable electric power tool used for drilling it has a high speed motor to revolve the chuck it is used to make holes smoothly and easily bench wise bench wise is used to grip the job object it has base plate fixed jaw and moving jaw chain pulley it is a pulley with depressions in the periphery of its wheel or projections from it made to fit the links of a chain a chain pulley of the desired capacity is hooked at the center to lift heavy loads for loading and unloading at the site tripod tripod is a combination of 3 to 4 meter long 40 mm gi pipes hinged at the upper end to form a tripod ratchet device it is a device consisting of a bar or wheel with a set of angled teeth in which a pawl cog or tooth engages allowing motion in one direction only ratchets are widely used in machinery and tools as well as maintenance works crowbar a crowbar is used for opening the wooden slab of a cable drum as well as hooking the drum on the wheel while laying cables and conductors pickaxe pickaxe is used for breaking up hard soil to prepare the trench or pit hoe hoe is used for digging the soil for various activities such as preparing cable trench or a pit for pole erection shovel a shovel is used for digging lifting and moving materials such as soil gravel snow and sand hand cart the hand cart is used for local transportation of material tools and tackles from the site store to the workplace twisting wrench twisting wrench used for twisting and tightening the end of overhead conductors acsr overshackle insulators cable roller cable roller is used for pulling cables it helps in easy movement the flow of cable pulled during the laying of cables it is of two types ratchet ratchet is a device consisting of a bar or wheel with a set of angled teeth in which a pawl cog or tooth is engaged allowing motion in one direction only face tester face tester is used to identify or test the face live hot or positive wire or conductor nose pliers nose pliers are cutting and holding pliers to bend reposition and snip wires electrician's knife an electrician's knife comprises an integral thick insulation and a substantially flat tube which serves as a sheath for receiving the cutting blade chisel it is a metal tool with a flat sharp end that is used to cut and shape a solid material file it is a tool usually of hardened steel with cutting ridges for forming or smoothing surfaces especially of metal wood saw it is used to cut pieces of wood into different shapes this is usually done to join pieces of wood together and carve a wooden object center punch it is a tool consisting of a metal rod with a conical point for making an indentation to allow a drill to make a hole at the same spot without slipping line wise line wise is portable wise used in overhead system to catch grip and sag the conductors draw tong or dags it is used to draw overhead conductor during line erection and fitting the pin insulator over newly erected poles to maintain the sag between lines in this video presentation you have seen personal protective equipment PPE and tools and plants T and P